So higher SPF is better. So anywhere between a 30 to 50 is a good SPF. Um, higher, obviously you get a, so how, do, basically what do you see in a tube? You said, oh, I didn't know what to pick up. Yes. So SPF is a common knowledge, yes. right? Then there is TPA, which TPA. is TAN, TPA, mm. TAN Protection Index. It is actually TPI and TPA, I forgot what that is. But it's TPA, TAN Protection Index it is, uh, which was again a Unilever's discovery actually, or an invention. So it's a TAN Protection Index they give. Um, so um, SPF is usually by number. So you say 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, whatever, Correct. till 100. Till 100? Till 100. I see. But later there were newer papers, earlier, higher the number, yes. better. They used to, I remember there was one particular company saying, company, sport, 80 SPF. Some other company, something, 70 SPF. So people would, 98 SPF I've seen once when I was traveling. So people used to go crazy. But now the newer papers say, after 50, the protection that it offers is... Only some point oh, zero three or something I like see. that. That's where so many is 50. The, yeah, oh. 99 point something already by your 50. So after that, it doesn't really add more value. So 50 is enough. Each number gives you a protection theoretically of 10 minutes under the sun. Each digit. So when you say 50, you're saying 500 minutes under the sun protected. But there's a trick to it. The, the catch to it is the amount of sunscreen you need. It's not just the SPF. To attain that SPF on your face, you need to have a spoonful. Wow. So these days we say two finger length. So you have to put two finger length for your face and neck. But trust me, you cannot look like one cake no matter how great the sunscreen is. Is that right? So most of us won't do it. So my do point is don't bit, uh, say... 50 is 500, be happily, merrily under the sun after four hours of applying sunscreen, it is not going to work. Most important thing is you need to reapply. Yeah, but how, how can you do it? I don't. I'm telling everyone reapply. <laughs> well, where do I have the time? Or then... I'm, like, no, no, I'm not even applying to start with. I'm yeah, just <laughs> impossible. Yeah, I apply religiously five every morning. But then again, to reapply in the afternoon is impossible. I don't have time to eat in the clinic once I get in. Where am I reapplying? I can't, but... If you're out in the sun, a reapplying is a very good thing. Therefore, you can choose powders, which can simply go on top. You can just dab them. That's reapplication. Two, there are sticks which are lovely. That the only time I really religiously reapply is when I'm on a holiday. So I'm out in the sun. I'm doing what I want. I just always in my bag, I have one sunscreen stick. Mm. Usually lasts for four hours. Usually. It won't. It won't. Because like I said, we won't apply so much. So Even if you're using hours. 50, two to three hours reapply. I thought I'm paranoid like I told you right now because I'm in that age and I'm paranoid. So every one hour I'll keep putting my sunscreen stick. <laughs> and my daughter recorded me one day and put it up on Instagram also. 